Hallo und herzlich willkommen zu einer neuen Folge Let's Play Life is Strange, nun mit Episode 3, Chaos Theory. Aber wir schauen uns nochmal kurz diesen Rückblick hier an. I think it's awesome you set a tongue record on video. <laughs> You're going to be sorry someday. And there she is. How are you doing, Max? Hi, Joyce. I am so sorry about William. I have great memories of him. That was his gift to us. Wonderful memories. Let's talk about your superpower. Hey, it's Thelma and Louise. You're my business now. That's and I... Rachel's bracelet. Why the fuck are you wearing her bracelet? You want me to cut you, bitch? Please, step back. You're kidding. Put that down. Please, get me out of here! Max! Nobody cares about me. Nobody. <laughs> What are you doing here, Max? Now, I know today was difficult for everybody. Miss Coffee, why exactly were you on the route with Kate Marsh? Please, tell us everything. What the hell is this? Max, there was no eclipse scheduled today. I believe you, Warren. I believe anything this week. Schöner Rückblick. Ganz nicer Rückblick. Life is Strange is a story-based game that features player choice. The consequences of all our game actions and decisions will impact the past, present and future. Choose wisely. Square Enix. Oh, die Klügermchen. Theory. Oh, und wir passen trotzdem auf ihr kleines Häschen auf, Mümmel, Mümmel. Fühlt sich gut an, Kate gerettet zu haben. I have something to show you. Meet me in the front of the campus. Get that ass in gear now. Chloe would be all over this, so I better get moving. Nicht ganz. There's been so much going on. I almost forgot about the eclipse. All this atmospheric action can't be a coincidence. And all roads are leading to my tornado vision. Gut, dann sollten wir ihn trotzdem mal. Here, nosh on this. Oh, I'm sorry, Lisa. I saved Kate, but I drowned my own plant. Ich hab sie doch immer gekossen. Hmm. Hmm. Naja. Warren. Yo, yo, Max. Just had to remind you again how fucking awesome you were today. With Kate on the roof, I'll make you a superhero suit on the Labs 3D printer. Cool? 
and you totally earned dinner on me, along with our escape to a planet of apes. Call me. Thanks, Warren. I need to rest my cape tonight, especially since I got Mr. Jefferson kicked out of his own contest. I'll call you later, okay? Mom. Thanks for letting me gush over our Blackwell hero. I miss your voice. We're very proud, so milk. So milk this moment. Let us know if you want to come up for a quick getaway, okay? We love you, Maxine. I have something to show you. Meet me in the front of the campus. Got that ass in gear now. Aber ich habe doch immer gedacht. Diese Dings. Wir hätten unsere Pflanze gegossen. Naja, egal. Hol mal ganz kurz. Now she has another video of herself all over the web. And even I'm in this one. Oh, at least the news didn't mention my name. Yet. A student at a prestigious Blackwell Academy almost jumped on the roof of a campus dormitory today. With most of the student and faculty as startled witnesses. Authorities confirm that the student Kate Marsh, 18, had been troubled, but information is scarce at this time. Thousand, dozens of cell phones recorded the event, which ended with an unidentified student talking, take, uh, talking Marsh down to, uh, to safety. Click here for the video and uh, further details. Hmm. Besides Rachel, it's been a while since anybody vanished from Arcadia Bay. I shouldn't sound so disappointed. I sure hope these people treat her better when she comes back to school. If she does. Get well soon. You're in our heart. Victoria. Sending love to you, Kate. Wegen Victoria is she doch erst... <sighs> Wegen Victoria und Courtney und Taylor ist sie doch erst dort, wo sie jetzt... Ah, es ah, tut weh. Das macht wütend. Die Einzige, die hier... Dass, die, 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 dass der Priester da schreibt, ist auch... Äh, nicht das, was er da schreibt, sondern dass er da schreibt, ist auch schon hart an der Grenze. Einzige, die hier wirklich was schreiben dürfte, wäre Alicia. Man, I really turned a molehill into a mountain. I feel bad for Mr. Jefferson about this. This is a page created by the student support Mr. Mark Jefferson after he was unfairly removed from the responding Blackwell Academy at the National Everyday Hero event in San Francisco for reasons unknown. We are not aligned with the school faculty, only students expressing our outrage and numerous fuck this Nazi bullshit. <laughs> Bring back Mr. Jefferson! Warren Graham, Jefferson Power! <laughs> Die Na äh, mit der Clowns Nase. Either I delete my page or I block everybody. Nowhere to hide these days. Max Power, watching you walk down with Kate from that Roof was the greatest thing I've ever seen in my life. Thank you. Dana, your hero, Max, thank you. Way to make the headlines. Way to make the headlines, uh, Max. Epic. Daniel. Immer so spanisch. Um, even. Time is bank, Douglas Adams. But Everybody will be talking about Kate now. Blackwell might as well shut down for the next month. You know you're hurting when you don't give a shit about music. It's amazing how happy Kate looks here compared to today. She was basically pushed up to that roof. And I will use my power to find out why. This has to end. Jeebus, I am so freaking tired. <laughs> I sound like a moron. But crime does not delay. I need to stay on top of this investigation. Kate's okay, Max. Take a breath. 
Get your shit together. You have time. Hier kann ich nichts machen, außer hier mal kurz auf den Plan gucken. Pretty hard to focus on my class schedule this week. I wonder why. Gut, wenn ich da mal so gucke, morgen hätten wir eigentlich schon um 10 Uhr World History. Englisch fällt ja immer aus aktuell. Da haben wir montags und mittwochs, müssen wir morgens hin, donnerstags und freitags. Haben wir morgens die erste Stunde frei. Dann hätten wir Algebra. Oh. Dann hätten wir, sagen wir mal, Mittagessen. Photographie Lab. Hätte ich nicht eigentlich dann doch... Ach, the language of photography ist, ist okay. Und dann Live Drawing. Ich meine, da ist Science und Media ist ja schon mehr oder weniger ausgefallen gestern. Ich kenne meinen eigenen... Also ich kannte meine eigenen Stundenpläne nicht so gut, wie ich hier ich Stundenpläne kontrolliere. Okay, this is scary dark. Let there be... That's a depressing thought. And it's always about Victoria. We'll wait for Kate. Broke. So much. We miss you. Yep. Do they really need that crap on the door? Kate's still alive. I hope you burn bright again soon, Kate. Und noch was steht da mal drauf? I hope you burn bright again soon, Kate. Burning bright in the forest of the night. Wet. What immortal hand or else would? Ach, ist egal. Power open. I hope Victoria feels particularly shitty about posting that link. Hey Max, I saw you go up on the roof and save Kate. I can't believe she tried to jump. <lacht> Schwere Entscheidung. Können Sie richtig runterputzen und gegen uns aufbringen? Ah, vielleicht wird sie wach. Wir können ja rückspulen. You should believe it. She almost jumped because you and everybody here bullied her. What? You're like blaming me? As a matter of fact, yes. Then just get out of here. Like, stop fucking with me. I already told you that my mom is in the hospital. I'm done for the day. Okay, wir probieren noch die andere Möglichkeit aus. Max, I saw you. I can. I'm just so glad she didn't. Are you okay? I'm just like shocked. I've never seen anybody try to kill themselves before. Me neither. I didn't think you'd be so upset considering how much shit you and Victoria gave Kate. I'm my own person, not Victoria's bitch. Hello, like she's freaking too. She already broke curfew tonight. <gasps> shit, I'm not supposed to tell anybody. Wir können ja noch mal zurückspulen. I won't say a word. I swear to dog. I believe you, Max. Besides Victoria, you're the only one who asked me about my mom in the hospital. That meant a lot to me. I'm my own person too. Let me know if you need anything. Thanks. You're like weird, but pretty cool, Max. Especially after watching you go up on that roof. Victoria's wrong about you. Now I have to be alone for my nightly anxiety attack. Talk to you later. Jetzt haben wir irgendwas gefunden. Max. I know. Victoria must be upset since I saw her sneaking out of the dorm past curfew. Oh man, like you saw her? She was so like nervous when she left the dorm. She wouldn't even tell me where she was going. Probably to hell. Well, I have to go crash. <laughs> It's been a rough day, as you know. Thanks, Max. 
And it was, like, pretty awesome when you went up to the roof to save Kate. Victoria was wrong about you. Now I have to be alone for my nightly anxiety attack. Talk to you later. Hmm. War das jetzt besser oder schlechter? Jeez. Taylor actually seems concerned about Kate. I, like, really do need to get some sleep, Max. Oh, Victoria isn't here. Maybe I'll just wait and bide my time. Going through her shit. Since I've crossed the line from Snoop to Detective, I might as well search for These socks cost more than my wardrobe. I'll title this one, Portrait de la Assholes. Whoa, there's Kate. Totally high. She looks confused. Not like she's partying. Here they are getting loaded with Satan. Ja, oder haben einfach nur Metal gehört? That's a lot of bank just to clean paint from a sweater. Order day, uh, uh, cashmere sweater, shorten to the kid. Blah, 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 yeah. Victoria's secret, she's a geek. Glow in the dark, blubbery. Ein PC gehe ich gleich. First Rachel and now Kate. This is the end of the Vortex Club. A unique point of view is right. Thanks to Courtney Wagner ghostwriting this paper. Excellent, well-researched essay with a unique point of view. A. Victoria Chase, Mr. Jefferson Art Class, Blackwell Academy, October 1, 2013. Essay, Noir and Day, Ex Expressionist Photography by Victoria Chase. Whoa, I had no idea Victoria's parents owned the Chase space. Color. Victoria is about as street as me, but she really appreciates style. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Ah, und die Schuhe haben wir nicht are made for walking runways. Those boots are made for walking. Just as what they do. Keine Ahnung. Well, well. Victoria and Taylor actually show remorse. From Victoria to Taylor. Hey, sweet tea. What up? I'm just avoiding some lame, some lame assigned homework. How can anybody do fucking homework after somebody almost jumps off a roof? I can't believe we all see it live. It was like watching a reality show, and I've never seen the campus so quiet. Like everybody hiding or afraid. Yes, I feel like total shit for everything I said about Kate in that stupid video. Let's get some peeps to meet up later. This girl needs a serious curfew cocktail. We drink to Ka we'll drink to Kate. From Taylor to Victoria. What a trip that was today. Seeing Max and Kate like that. I need a drink too. Let me know the time. Sweet tea. Wer war nochmal Taylor? Wer war nochmal Taylor? Lass mal ganz kurz gucken. Wer war Taylor? Wer war Taylor? Da, Person. Jefferson, Kate, Victoria, Nathan, Principal, Warren, Chloe, Rachel, Troy, Strank. Nee, Taylor ist da nicht dabei. Nothing to see here. I guess I shouldn't be so bummed. Not that Victoria couldn't hide her shit. Man, I'm getting paranoid. Hm. Da haben wir doch schon reingeguckt, oder? Da ist nichts. Die Schuhe haben wir übersehen. Aber wir können mal ganz kurz hier noch das lesen, was das letzte Mal. Next haben wir, haben wir, haben wir. Kate admitted that she thinks something more happened to her than just video she told. Another belief, Kate's been seeing what the person of Nathan is even seen myself exactly. 
The fuck has capital off, of course. Uh, Mm, Warren, okay. It's been of Zepson, David Madsen stopped, okay. Kate Marsh almost killed herself. My hands are still shaking, but I have to write this down while I can. Right at the start of Jefferson's class, Kate went to the roof of the girls' dorm to, uh, to jump. Every student and teacher was watching her like it was Blackpool rooftop concert. I saw her actually jump, but I was just about able to use my rind to get her back on the roof. I tried harder than ever, than I ever did, and somehow I stopped this con time completely. I made it to the roof, but again my head felt like it was going to blow up. I knew that I couldn't use, ch I couldn't just keep rewinding to save Kate. I had to try and talk uh, uh, down on my own. She was already in so much pain over the video and all the bullying. She wasn't going to buy everything I tried to tell her. You see movies with people trying to talk somebody out of suicide, but it's very different when I'm the one doing the talking. I covered everything I could and Kate almost jumped anyway. Cliché or not, I told her how much her friends and family love her, even if they don't all show it now. Lou and... Uh-uh. Lo and behold, Kate stepped back from the ledge. Alive, I almost cried in her arms. I know this isn't about me, me though. I have to admit, it wasn't. An, it was an amazing feeling to walk arm in arm with Kate on the roof to outside the dorm. Like I said, the whole school and police were watching us, almost completely silent. Then I heard what sounded like Logan yelling out, "Give it up for Max!" And everybody started to clap and cheer, talk about surreal. The people who ignored me or treated me like crap suddenly crushing on me? That might be the strangest thing I ha that's happened to me this insane week. And what? And that made me wonder if Victoria was watching and how she felt about all this. I almost wanted to find her just to get her in her smug face for enabling Kate's suicide attempt. Such cruel bullshit. Though, to be fair, Victoria wasn't the only one that was responsible. Nathan Prescott seemed to have disappeared, which probably, a, which was probably a good thing. And after all that, I still had to w had to talk to to the police and give a statement. Felt so weird to do since I've seen it in pretty much every police producer show. I had to lie my ass off when he questioned me about the other students because I just don't think the police are ever going to find out what happened. Yes, this looks like a job for Supermax, right? Though of course I do love it when Chloe calls me that, even if I don't feel that every day he heroic for helping Kate down. Maybe it's wrong. It's wrong for me to think I have to feel anything, but grateful that Kate didn't jump. What was really odd was when all the students and faculty staff surrounded me and Kate then started patting our backs and sh uh, shoulders like we were heroes. It wasn't sure how to respond considering Kate almost threw herself off the roof because of everybody at the school, but like I said, I can't blame everybody. I, and I still don't really know where to point all my fingers. The ver very best thing was, even though Kate was still in tears and confused, I definitely saw her smile once she realized how happy everybody was that she was alive. I smiled too. The police and paramedics swooped in and swooped in, and then Kate was covered in a blanket and gently escorted to the ambulance. They didn't thank me or look at me like I was a hero. I guess they're used to saving people without applause. But if I'm super honest, I felt pretty cool. Look, like I got a hug from the whole school, so maybe Blackwell Academy isn't totally bad. It's not enough that Kate is alive and though I'm not enough of an egomaniac to take the credit, I still had to get the Blackwell third degree from Principal Wells. It was bizarre to be in the, in his techy office with Nathan Prescott, David Madsen and Mr. Chevelin, Mr. Jefferson calmly talking about why Kate wouldn't attempt suicide. I was quite but 
Chitty inside, just replying in my head the moment when Kate stepped toward me with a glimmer of hope in her eyes. Still, I ended up telling the principal that I saw Kate crying after she talked with Mr. Jefferson. I wasn't trying to blame him, I just thought it was important in important information. Maybe I fucked up, harsing on the one person I respect the most at, Black at Blackwell. I could see Mr. Jefferson was disappointed in me too. The principal was more upset because he pulled Jefferson out from representing the school at the Everyday Heroes contest. I didn't expect that at all. I'm so confused right now. How can I keep going to Mr. Jefferson's class after I ruined his reputation? And do I still have to give him a photo for the contest? After being grilled in the principal's den, I hung out with Warren on the lawn so I could feel grass under my feet and watch the fluffy clouds. He's such a sweetheart. He kept talking me how proud he was that I stopped Kate from jumping. I don't believe that I did, but I have to say it's better to be treated like a hero at school than like a twee loser. Still, I told Warren that something ominous is happening at Blackwell Academy. Rachel Amber, Chloe and now Kate have all been victims. Not to mention me if I keep playing amateur detective. Wish I could have let Warren know about my power, but it's not the right time. As if anything is the right time anymore. And to make the day end at the most surreal note possible, the sky went dark. And we watched a scholar ex eclipse that was not announced in the news or any astronomy site. What is happening to Acadia Bay? So. Das haben wir schon mal. Und deswegen können wir jetzt den Ort verlassen. Und... Dana's really hurting over this. Waiting for you, Kate. Hey, Dana. How are you doing? Better than Kate. I just can't believe she would even attempt suicide. <laughs> oh, toll. Diese Antwortmöglichkeiten hätte ich mir jetzt nicht gewünscht. Ach, wie blöd. Ich glaube, she was, um, she was depressed. I knew she was depressed, but I had no idea how bad. Must be serious to throw yourself off the roof. Kate was serious. But it's not all about that video. So what exactly are you saying, Max? I know Jefferson got reamed by the principal. Do you think they're involved? I'm not sure yet, but I'm on it. Weird shit is going down at Blackwell. And I'm going to find out why. I'm getting scared now. But people here are still sneaking out tonight. What? Like, who? Victoria bounced out of here earlier, and now you, Sharla? Not me. I need a break from today. Get some sleep too, Dana. I'll see you later. Hmm. Das Gespräch führen wir gerade mal neu führen. Hey, Dana. Better than Kate. Come on, don't blame yourself. There are other people involved, like Victoria Chase. She definitely deserves a face punch for pimping that video. I didn't do enough to step up. Now it's time for serious payback. In other words, revenge. So what exactly are you saying, Max? I know Jefferson got reamed by the principal. Do you think they're involved? I'm not sure yet, but I'm on it. Weird shit is going down at Blackwell. And I'm going to find out why. I'm getting scared now. But people here are still sneaking out tonight. What? Like, who? Victoria bounced out of here earlier, and now you, Sharla? Not me. I need a break from today. Get some sleep too, Dana. I'll see you later. 
Und immer noch ein bisschen schade finde. This is both sad and pathetic. Das kennen wir doch schon. Yes, the Vortex Club does indeed suck. Aww, Trevor is a sweetie. Good for Dana. Ähm, ist das dasselbe? Wie hier sind ja eben. Hey Dana, I've been thinking about you all the, all day and now how hard it it was for you to see Kate almost jump from the roof today. Glad that Max swooped in like a superhero. I don't have anything deep or smart to say. I just want you to know that you're a good friend to Kate and I wish she had more friends like you. You have been so good for me when everything else is so fucked up and I'm here for always. I miss you, Trev. From Dana to Trevor, thank you so much for thinking of me. I keep seeing Kate on the roof and I feel like I should have done more to help her. Max did more than anybody to save Kate and I don't even think they're BFF. So happy you're thinking about me. I can't wait to see you tomorrow and you are just as good for me as you think I am for you. Dreaming of you tonight. XO XO Dana. She's gonna wish she didn't. Dana, I hope you're doing okay after today. I don't want to bother you, but I'm writing an article about Kate for the paper, and I wanted to know if you could answer just a few short questions. It seems like there are too few answers. Let's talk when it's confident like for you, okay? Hope you are well. Sincerely, Juliet. From Dana. Hey, Juliet. I know you want to find out more about Kate, but I'm still a little shaken up after today. I don't think you'll go to many answers so soon after what happened today. And maybe it's better to keep a low profile for the moment. Kate deserves some privacy for a change. Dana. Hey. Then I would like to make a conversation with Hey, Dean. Better than... I think we're all responsible for what happened. True. But you're the only one who went up to that roof with Kate. Um. I was lucky. That's all. No, girl. That was not luck. You made a choice to save her. Like a superhero. Then maybe it's time to catch the bad guys. So what exactly are you saying? I know Jefferson got reamed by the principal. I'm not sh I'm getting s What? Victoria. So, das erkennen wir ja alles schon, können wir überspringen. So, das ist jetzt ein Gesprächsfall, auf dem mir am besten gefallen hat. Stella, Kate, just want you to know. Was steht da genau? Ich kann die Schrift nicht lesen. Just want you to know you're in our thoughts. Chloe is waiting for me in front of the main hall. I feel so... giddy, even after Kate almost jumped. Maybe it's the leftover adrenaline. But I feel kind of invincible now. Okay, da kommt jetzt nichts mehr Neues. Da da käme noch was. Oh, the most magical insects. Burn bright. Warum konnte ich den Chloe Max? Oh nee, die drei Seiten lese ich jetzt aber nicht. Die lesen wir das nächste Mal nochmal. 
kann ich das Quirrell nicht? Das kann ich nicht malen. Maybe Samuel should fix that lamp. The Tabanka does look pretty scary at night. Please don't destroy me. Okay. Nee, noch mal hinsetzen. Brauchen wir nicht, haben wir schon. Christopher Wells. Oh, are you serious? I'm toast if he sees me. Nobody can expel me. Not yet, anyway. Blackwell almost lost another student. I wish Kate Marsh would have just skipped town. Now I have to deal with more pissed off entitled parents who want to miss Caulfield. You have to be stealthier than that. You're not supposed to be outside your dormitory at this hour. You know that. Uh, I'm sorry, Principal Wells. I'm still tense after I thought Kate was going to jump today. I just needed some air and space to walk. No, no explanations. Seeing Kate come up on that roof, then seeing her come down with you. You saved her ass. <sighs> Maybe saved Blackwell. Now don't get cocky. Going back inside. You earned good dreams. Great. So how do I get past him to meet Chloe? Hmm. Ha! Oh, it's unlocked. I hope Samuel isn't around. Nothing here. Who knew Samuel was so into runway fashion? Just hier drin können wir es nicht ausmachen. Girl stuff. I know Samuel doesn't wear silky scarves. So, who does? Nuts and bolts. <laughs> like my grandpa's garage. Mhm. Mm Aber das ist... Ah, da haben wir noch was. Nothing but tools. Ich nicht. Ich kapier es nicht. Maybe Samuel should fix that lamp. I know I have a set of keys on me somewhere. Ah, gotcha. Now, why won't they fit? These keys are all broken. Or maybe it's me. Look at 
the lens and say nut. Gotcha. Okay. Dann mal Chloe's SMS. Hello, Max. Hello. Oh, und da haben wir Scrabble. Und wir haben die leuchtende Figur von ihr nicht fotografiert. Können wir da nochmal zurück? Kann ich das nochmal machen? Nein, können wir nicht. Egal. Und jetzt eh zu ihnen hier nochmal zu. Max the Ninja strikes again. So. Like I'm a scary punk ghost. More like a scary punk asshole. Hey, Chloe, I didn't exactly have the greatest day trying to keep my friend from jumping off the roof. I don't think I need you to prank me tonight, okay? Sorry, but you absolutely balls to the walls did save your friend. Kate saved herself. I couldn't even use my power. My head felt like it was being crushed. And then I had no clue what to say to her on that roof. Don't be so modest, Rockstar. Kate is alive because of you. You obviously said the right thing. And your badass power is gonna save us all. We just need to connect the plays. And find out who almost killed Kate. We have to stop this from happening to anybody else. Oh yeah, and somehow stop that tornado from wiping out Arcadia Bay, right? Didn't you say that it was all about chaos theory? I don't see any control over this chaos. Oh, right. Except for your ability to... Oh, yeah. Manipulate time and space? No biggie. Chloe, I just feel weird about some of my decisions. Especially after I just got Mr. Jefferson in trouble. Dude, do not even torture yourself like that. Let's focus on looking for clues, okay? About... Rachel. We need to find out more about who Rachel was involved with around here. She was able to blend in with everybody, even with people I hated. And even though I don't know her, it feels like Rachel is guiding us to the truth. Fuck the truth. I just want to find my friend right now. It scares me to think where she could be. Do you think she's... Kicking it in Los Angeles? That would be the best case scenario. She wouldn't leave without me, okay? And how often do missing girls turn up? We have to find Rachel soon. We have to. I promise you we will. Like you said, it's time to start the search for clues. Now tell me what's your secret. Drum roll, please. I present the spare keys to Blackwell. Thank you, step prick. You are such a boss, Chloe. I just don't want you to get into any more trouble. Look at all the trouble dropping in Arcadia Bay. At this point, who gives a fuck anymore? We're in it to win it, Max. Lead the way. I'm so glad you're my partner in crime. As long as you're my partner in time. Insert groan here. Okay. Thank you again so much for helping me put together a portfolio. Hopefully the rest of the class will follow your lead. I'm sorry I was distracted. As you know, it's not been a good day for Blackwell. I know this has been an awful day and you can talk to me anytime, Mr. Jefferson. Thank you, Victoria. I'm glad it had a relatively happy ending. I don't know what I would have done if Katie jumped. Katie? I had no idea you two were that close. Did she? Well, how does this affect the Everyday Heroes contest? The contest will go on. I just won't be representing Blackwell at the event this year, thanks to Max, who claims I enabled Kate Marsh's trouble by merely listening to her. I'll give you a one-word sneak preview of Max's photo. Selfie. Listen, you've seen my entry. You know it's better than that. Wouldn't that be so cool to hang out together in San Francisco, Mark? Stick to Mr. Jefferson, Victoria. 
I won't be going to San Francisco, remember? You already love my work, so it's not like you're playing favorites. Just imagine if you picked my photo, though. We would have to spend a lot of time together. That could be fun. Alter, was für eine Bitch. You might as well choose me. Otherwise, I might have to tell people you offered to choose my photo for favors or something. As a favor to your future, I'll also ignore that undisguised threat. This conversation is officially over, Miss Chase. I suggest you go back to your dorm now. Wait! I only... Er steht nicht auf dich. Fucking kidding me. So stupid. Just when I think Victoria can't get any more evil. Shit is about to get real at Blackwell. Let's go find out. Okay, spielen wir ein bisschen Einbrecher. Chloe the Keymaster. You know it. Dude, I don't know about this. We're both already in so much trouble. Not to mention the weed you brought into my room. Joking. I'm serious. We're not kids anymore. We're breaking and entering. If I have a key, how can it be breaking? They can't charge us for just entering. I'm serious. We could go to jail. Not if I'm related to the head of Blackwell security. Step shit will not want me in the hands of the local police. So we better find out what's in the principal's office first. You can rewind if we get caught, right? You have mad powers, Max. But my powers didn't save Kate. Maybe I did on my own. Come on. One more door and our work here is done. Das war nur das Poster, das wir uns anschauen konnten. A long time ago, in a girl's room right here. Mhm. Squirrels like nuts. Does that mean Samuel is... Total phony would wear a crappy hat like that. That's it. What the fuck? The security officer should have the key to the principal's office. He's hiding shit, like everybody here. Well, now we definitely have to get this door open. Believe it or not, I know a little about lockpicking, thanks to Frank. I might as well test out my thief skill. Go for it. We're already in this deep. Well, you could look for the key. Just in case. Why, yes, I could. Uh -huh. <sighs> no keys here. Desolation. Here are the keys. Ugh, none for the principal's office. Crap. Boring. Dead end. No key for thee. We have to find another way in. Guess I didn't spend enough time with Frank. But I'll use my DIY lockpick tools while you come up with a better plan. My plan has a name. Hey Warren, you busy? Just bubble hearth, you'll be okay. Listen, I need your physics expertise stat. 
without naming names, if somebody had access to the art and science labs and wanted to construct a device that would, say, open a locked door, would you maybe kind of know how? Huh? No, I'm just asking for fun. Thanks, science guy. Uh, no, 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 stay. We need you as backup. Just send the text instructions now. Yes, I'm still all in to go ape with you at the drive-in. Thanks for the hope. This sucks ass. Goddamn door. Try not to wake up everybody at Blackwell. Sorry, Max. I got nothing. What about your plan? I'm gonna go put it together. Can you stay here and not get caught? I might get on the other side of that door before you, Lupin. The race is on. See you soon. Stop button. Any questions? Sodium chlor, what the fuck? It's just a powder used to create chlorine dioxide. Shit, everybody knows that. So, are you really going to try this? Keyword is try. I bow to your wisdom. Sugar, soda can, duct tape and sodium chlorate. How you do it? Any question? Kann so schwer nicht sein, das zu basteln. Warren is such a classic nerd. Let's see if I can find those items. Gross. Ist jetzt tatsächlich hier noch rein? Rückt. Nothing here. I hate that formalin smell. An A minus? All right, all right. So Dr. Max did help Warren this morning. <laughs> Haben wir schon mal den Zucker? Ooh, sugar. Only three more items to go. Mal hier für ein Diagramm. I never said they were great, troll. I never said they were great, troll. Max take shitty surface, okay. Sodium chloride is a weed killer. You'd think Warren would have told me that factoid. The property of sodium chloride, um, natrium chloride, uh, 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 or trichloride, trichloride, natrium trichloride is an. Uh, Inorganic compound that is com commonly used as the weed killer. Toxic to humans. Weed killer. Here's the sodium chloride box. You know you're clumsy, Max. Don't waste your rewind power. Use the damn chair. <laughs> Wie sie dazu lernt im Laufe der Zeit, das finde ich auch lustig. Also gut gemacht. Man hat das Gefühl, man selbst hätte ihr das mit der Zeit beigebracht. Wenn das natürlich nicht so ist. Warren, you're still there? Did you blow up? Max? Still here, didn't blow up. Not yet. I need to concentrate now. Talk to you later.
irgendwo eine Möglichkeit geben, die anderen Gegenstände hier zu finden. Everybody's asleep. I hate to wake them up, but I want a picture. Good evening, fish fish. Thanks, fish. Nice work. Please resume your slumber. Gehen wir mal noch weiter suchen. Irgendwo werden wir doch sicherlich... Was brauchen wir alles nochmal? Ducktape und... Ähm also, Sodium Chlorid haben wir. Sugar haben wir. Soda Can und Ducktape. This is like a scene in a horror film. Mm -hmm. Oh, Kate. Even when you were sad, you tried to see the good in the world. Shit. Victoria. That is pretty fucking sweet. How can I hate somebody that shoots like that? Ganz einfach, indem man ihn einfach hasst. So leicht kann man jemand hassen. Daniel's a better illustrator than photographer, said Max, the art critic. Mm -hmm. I say one stupid thing and Mr. Jefferson gets screwed. Nice going, Max. From Principal Worlds. To Mark Jefferson. Dear Mark, I just wanted to drop you an informal note to let you know that Blackwell is conducting an investigation into the events of this week. You'll be receiving an official notice in the mail. But you deserve to be told about the, uh, this now. I respect your work and your state and status here at Blackwell and hope you won't think too harshly of me in this very difficult time. I hope this all works out in our in your favor. Mm -hmm. I feel gross even looking at Nathan's work, but he does have some style. You can never escape the lighthouse here. Victoria's cigarettes? <laughs> I'm sure Mr. Jefferson is impressed. Ducktape, 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 was doch gut hier zu gehen, haben wir die dritte Zutat. The tape is mine. Only one more ingredient left. Hier kennt man nicht an den PC. Und unsere Bank. Und da ist auch nichts. Zigaretten haben wir uns angeguckt, da sind wir auch fertig. Jetzt hier hin, wahrscheinlich die Dunkelkammer. Das haben wir uns angeguckt. Ja, dann sind wir hier fertig. Ich hoffe, ich habe jetzt nichts in einem der beiden Räume hier übersehen. Uns fehlt nämlich noch eine Zutat und da ist sie doch. Okay, I have the can. Now it's time to show Chloe that Max is the bomb. Falsch abgebogen. Nochmal falsch abgebogen. Hier sind wir richtig. Take it easy on the door, Chloe. Let's try this instead. Boom! Literally. Yes! Time to blow shit up! If you'll light the candle. This is so cool! Get ready to haul ass. <lacht> <lacht> 